Uh, this is something that we've developed as members of the community. We have decided that uh, we are going to be issuing both tournaments for both Pound Upon and Pound Attack once a month. Uh, for those of you who want to know, the Pound Attack tournaments will be hosted every first Saturday of the month, whereas the Pound Upon tournaments will be hosted every third Wednesday of the month. So uh, go ahead and keep that in mind. But before we move on, I do want to show you guys the bracket. Let me also go ahead and post it on the Discord as well. That way my people can know. Ah, uh, one second. There's a lot of stuff going on here. One. January. Alright, awesome. Alright, now let me go ahead and show you guys what the bracket is going to look like for today. Alright, we have are currently already done our Swiss rounds. We are now going to be moving on to top 8. Top 8 is going to be single elimination, but there is going to be a third place match. So basically the loser of the semifinals will move on to play a bronze match. Why is this thing like so? I don't understand. I think my program just broke also. So, you know, yay to that. Shout outs to, uh, shout outs to Google for eating up the RAM, but it's fine. Uh, anyway... Give me one second here while we go ahead and put some stuff in the background. Oh, there we go. Sorry, I'm using this right now. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, all right. So, in our first bracket, we have Flying Turtle versus Captain Daddy, Tono 66 versus Kompata, Vane Chu versus Galaxy Blitz 26, and Tai versus GCT. I'm going to go ahead and share with these guys, let them know that the bracket has been posted. Um, make sure my program is good to go here. Uh, before I do that, let me go ahead and switch scenes real super quickly. That way y'all can actually see what the dump is going on. Let me go ahead and update a couple things here real super quickly. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, top eight has begun. First match of the set is going to be Flying Turtle versus Captain Daddy. Let me go and update the names real super quickly. It's always the long character names that always take up the most amount of space. That's fine. Let me move this over. Yoink. And... And then, player two, Captain Daddy. Again, long names. We'll shorten it for daddy. We'll, cat, we'll shorten it for sure. Captain Daddy. There we go. Nice and smooth and to the point. Alright. Sorry about this. We're ready for you guys to go. Captain Daddy versus Flying Turtle for the first round. Whenever these two gentlemen are ready to begin, we can uh, proceed. Let me go and message them real quickly. Uh... Yep, they're messing each other. Alright, we're waiting for them to get themselves ready. Okay. 
Oh, don't tell me crash. Am I standing still? Oh, God. Oh, God. I think we might start with no... Oh, wait, hold up. Yep, it crashed. Yay! Give me three seconds, chat, while we open the game. I'm pretty sure they're going in now, and that's fine. We're probably going to be late for, like, a little bit. That's fine. That's fine. We're all good. It's fine. No biggies. No biggies. They're starting, I believe. Stream broke. Yes, it did. All right. Give me three seconds while we set up. All right. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. Sometimes it do be like that. It do be like that. Anyway, let me go ahead and do player. And we're expecting them to go. Flying Turtle versus Captain Daddy for in the first match of Top 8. Nope. Uh, Rom person. Is this right? Uh, uh. Back to me when you. Uh. No. We're waiting for Flying Turtle now. Oh, they're starting. Yep, they are starting. They're just picking their characters, picking their stages. silence here uh, <laughs> we're just awaiting for them to accept their challenge I think that daddy's ready okay here we go we're beginning now so right off the bat flying turtle with a fork uh, with a fork chain cat daddy also breathe stale pretty safe oh goodness gracious cat daddy already on the defense right here flying turtle even get stacked a little bit. And there goes Turtle. <laughs> a little too much damage for Captain Daddy to handle that in one moment. So it's one to nil. Uh, both players are playing at level 10. So it is first to five victories. Uh, as a reminder, uh, <laughs> our tournaments are in our Discord server. So our information mark panel attack should be the command. If not, then I have to fix it. But generally speaking, uh, this should be fine. Captain Daddy going massive with an 11 chain right off the bat. But will that be enough? Maybe he's a little too much. Flying Turtle easily expected that. He's gonna have a good amount of work, to, uh, got a time to work with. He's gonna be playing this uh, this whole break the big garbage block game to see how big of a retaliation. Right now, Captain Daddy with almost no uh, garbage on his board. Gonna hand Turtle some free punishment. If I were Turtle right about now, I would cut that chain short. We'll chain do uh, turtle here. Continue with a nine uh, with a nine chain. Captain Daddy with almost no gar with almost no garbage. But oh, turtle cut it up in a nine chain. But Captain Daddy expecting it. Got that combo into clear. Flying turtle on the defensive now. Turtling in his little shell here. Captain Daddy tries to make a flash. Makes those blues into clear. Both players on the defensive, both players playing the elongated brick game, trying to figure out who's going to get to it first. Turtle with a good array, a nice four chain and com combat combo into clear. Captain Daddy with very few blocks to work with, more garbage than blocks. He is going to be in the star predicament. Okay, it's still stars connected. Doesn't move those hearts in the way that's going to cost him two to nail for, uh, on the side of Captain. Well, against Captain Daddy. 
Flying Turtles 2. Okay. Cap Daddy trying to go for a 3 chain, but doesn't quite time to go for another 2 chain with a fifth combo. Uh, both players haven't thrown much strong offense. Flying Turtle was patented 4 chain as a start off. Uh, retires with a 3. Will that be enough? Mm, not quite. He just throws a little bit. Oh, that might be enough. Cap Daddy trying to even up his stack. Just <laughs> that garbage as much as he can. Turtle already on the offense. If I were Turtle, he'd probably throw some free punishment. Here's a 5 combo. I'm gonna apologize for that. that. Oh. Tell the match to get that uh, daddy with that clear on the garbage. Go for a four, go for a five. He's gonna go big? Cuts it off at a five point. Now turn on the defensive. Captain Daddy with only combo uh, garbage to work with here. Uh, not much, but it can't get too it can't get hectic if it's too much of it. Uh, tries to line those little screens, but doesn't quite get it. Captain Daddy takes that one. Wow. What do you know? What a surprise. 2-2-1. Two, two, so Cap Daddy is gonna fight. He's not gonna get clean sweep here. You're wasting here we go, the stages. Cap, uh, Flying Turtle. Gotta move up in the offense. Going with a 6. A 6 chain. But only Cap Daddy only retaliates with a little bit of garbage here. Ooh, this is gonna be stiff. This is gonna be awkward. Cap Daddy has some blocks in second tier, but not enough to make any connection of any sort. Uh, Your world will be mine. Into... World will be mine. Cam Daddy being very aggressive here, replying with four chain, but having very few lots of words. We have enough time. He will not have enough time to make any any sort of moves. Three, two, one. Flying target going extremely high, very early on. Let's see if this will help him out. Ooh, gets that time again. Gets that five combo. Ooh. Strong offense, strong offense with some combo damage in there. So it's gonna hurt a lot. Uh, Captain Tur uh, Daddy already with blocks on the top, with garbage on the top. Turtle has that one roll still to go. Uh, we adjust those blues in the clear. Captain Daddy has a couple, never mind. He had some blocks in the second tier, but knocked that second tier down. <gasps> Ooh, he tried to match those blues for a four combo into clear, but couldn't quite get it in time. Oh, excuse me. There we go. Sorry about that. Alright, uh, it's match point for Turtle. Turtle wins, he moves on. Captain Daddy gets eliminated if he doesn't make it. This is tough. I think the only person, I think only one person I've actually gotten very close to uh, to taking a, uh, a set off of Flying Turtle, and that would be Galaxy Blitz with a 5 to 4 in Twist. But, we'll see if that happens today. Cam Daddy with some combo garbage to work with. Will that be enough? No, not quite. Turtle! Turtle! Turtle doesn't make a match though! Ooh, 4 to 2. Could Cam Daddy make a reverse comeback? We'll see. Who knows? One thing is certain, he will not leave. He is not leaving without a fight. And that is a certain. Oh, but Turtle's going big on the offense. What an 8 chain to retaliate! Start getting rid of that garbage almost immediately. Gets into a little bit of more combo garbage, but it's nothing to shake him off. Daddy still though on the key complete defensive here, with almost no room to work with. Oh, but Turtle with oh, but Daddy retaliates. Can then make a match. Daddy makes a two, makes a three, makes a four, makes a five into clear, keeping himself alive with throwing some good offense. Six with clear. Cuts it off on a six chain and continues forward. We're gonna make a match. Yo. Does. Turtle though. Ooh, turtle matching with those stars moves is out of, out of place. Ooh, Daddy with second and third tier, but those blues line up just perfectly for him to get the clear. How luck is that? But the meanwhile he's gonna do a lot more combo garbage. Meanwhile, Turtle has to do with some chain damage here, so it's only a matter of time of who gets to do what. Right now, Tanda has a couple of blocks. Probably might be looking at Ooh, five combo into clear. Ooh. Five. A six. Good comp uh good counter attack. Good counter attack. Turtle might be in trouble here. Ooh, get that five in though. This could be stiff. 
Four to clear. Five chain from Captain Daddy. He's putting, he's keeping the pressure on Turtle. <laughs> this, uh, this entire, this one game, he's been putting the pressure on Turtle. Right here, but will he, will he have enough to keep himself alive? No, he will not. There we go. Five to two for Captain Daddy. I mean, for against Captain Daddy. Flying Turtle wins. All right, let me go ahead and update the scoreboard here. Five to two. That means Flying Turtle moves on to the semifinals and Captain Daddy is eliminated. Now, yeah. Okay, the next match is, woo, we have two new competitors who have entered this tournament. Tobono66 versus Kompota. So, whenever you guys are ready, uh, feel free to start. Let me go ahead and message these people on the Discord. Uh, Next match is going to be, whoa, where's everything? Give me three seconds. Chat, let me go ahead. Oh, hold on. There we go. All right, come on the first Tobano. Uh oh. Oh, no, don't tell me crash. No, 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 no. Oh, okay, well, they're starting. They're starting. They're starting. Thanks, uh, Pal Attack. Uh, speaking of Pal Attack, uh, we've done a couple of changes to it. For one, we've reset the leaderboard. This is now a yearly thing that we do. We've now reset the yearly, uh, leaderboard every year. Uh, this is fantastic. This is great. I, I love I love the new I, I love the new season the new year's the new season the 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 first week of this game uh, in the new year is always everybody is jumping online right now to try to get their scores in. Uh, did they already play? Huh? Are they playing? What is going on? What is going on? Um, give me a sec. Okay, they're selecting. They're selecting. They're selecting. They're going. They're going. They're going. They're going. They're going. They're going. Okay, it just started. Let me read. Uh, fresh names real quick. Double here with a 18 combo. Both these players are, fr are, believe it or not, both these players are Japanese. So many of the ja oh, but doesn't quite get that in time. Will that add it? No, it will not. Well, that will. All right, Komporo against not Captain Daddy. Actually, Tobono. Let me actually update that. Tobono trying to go for the uh, good amount of garbage, which is a two combo with a massive amount of combos, but unfortunately did not have anything to work with that stack. Um, I think both players are aware of this style. Both players attempt this style as well. Uh, Kombota being more the uh, familiar one to uh, execute this combination uh, offense here. It is one interesting uh, matter of offense because essentially how the game works is that it sometimes uh, it's better to throw combos than chains. And depending on the size of the combo, it can even outmatch chain, uh, certain chain blocks. So it really depends about how you prioritize your blocks. Uh, they always say making a 7 combo is much better than making a 2 chain, despite the fact you're wasting one more block uh, due to the fact that <laughs> cutting it out of 2 chain is relatively not a good strategy to do. Uh, meanwhile, most players come up with that token over here. Uh, Kobota on the very defensive. Tobono. Tobono doesn't make any sort of combination at all. He just gets bombarded by combo garbage. Uh, let's see how this goes so far. Uh, we'll Kobota to try the combination strategy. Looks like it is. Goes for six. Another match of an offense. Tobono here. Lining his blocks up with a 13 combo. And another seven combo. Exactly, this is what I mean. And just like that, Kompota has some uh, garbage to deal with here. 
But I can see as of right now, Comporta is doing more of the fast-paced uh, combination damage. We're doing sevens and fives, anything below a ten. Meanwhile, uh, Tobodo always starts up the match like so and then switches to a defensive movement, which I don't think is working out for him. He's already 3-0, and oh, so Tobono has to change up his strategy somehow here. Uh, Tobono still going for that combination. Look at this man set up his board. Look at this other man set up. So it's only a matter of who gets it first. Nope. Uh, Komodo doesn't get anything out of his board. Doesn't quite make any match combination. I did not see that. Was that a 21? Was that a 21 combo? Tobono here doesn't quite get that. Ooh, it is 4 to nil. Tobono here obviously going for those, the big combination for swag points, but it's not giving him anything to work with here. Oh my goodness, Tobono. All right, Komodo with a 10 combo. A strong showing here. Tobono, Tobono. Tobono with a 15 combo. Interesting, with a 6 combo into clear. Oh my goodness gracious, this could be a clean sweep. Totem might have to come back here. Uh, Komodo here with a lot of garbage to work with from that <laughs> massive combination spam. Uh, but we turn around. Four, top, four chain, five chain. Sick dang! What a sweet switch movement. Look at that feet. speed. <gasps> that nine. Nine chain with oh, two very perfect tricks right there. Tobono on the very top of his board, having a little uh, more blocks than garbage to deal with. Uh, well, he have, I don't think he will have enough time to even rearrange those to make a combo. A massive combo spam. That's essentially like their opening move. Once their uh, <laughs> big old massive fear gets over with, uh, that's all they have to deal with. The Compola on second tier throws a massive chain over the Compola. Tobino here. Goes for two, goes for three. Four, oh, I set up perfectly for this. Right, six chain, not a bad offense, not a bad offense, pretty solid, pretty solid. Uh, Komodo on second tier, but can't make a combination of any sort, so she's gonna break that into... into blends, <sighs> matches those hearts, into clear. Tobino here, uh, goes for four, but doesn't quite get that clear in time. Ooh, no hair enough. <gasps> he doesn't have enough, he couldn't make it. It is 5-0 for, Com uh, for Tobino. Komodo wins on a clean sweep. 5-0, that is the... Ridiculous. That is insane. I gotta give massive respect to Tobono though. Tobono went out like a champion. He went, he decided, you know what, let's just do this for fancies. Let's just throw massive combinations. Eye-catching stuff. Really cool to see. Like, it's a very, very dangerous technique, but it's real, ex especially effective. The massive combinations. Uh, <laughs> the Japanese players are capable of, I can tell you that with honesty. 5-0. Come with the the next match is going to be Veng Chu versus Galaxy Blitz. Let me go ahead and message those guys real super quickly. All right, next match is Veng Chu versus Galaxy Blitz. Tobono definitely representing the Japanese swagger. Absolutely. The Japanese players are some of the craziest players you'll ever see uh, participating in this game. Uh, most of them do play, uh, they, they're very skilled to the point where they can play at level 9 and 10 and have the match last over 10 minutes on classic pound upon. So, I'm going to the names real super quickly. Vayne Chewers Galaxy Blitz early on. Uh. So Galaxy Blitz in a bit of danger here. Vayne should throw in this strong offense very early on. Uh, Vayne with no co uh, no garbage on the field, gonna give him some free punishment here, seven, com uh, seven combo, into clear here, a little, but Galaxy Blitz only throwing little bits of garbage, oh he goes a big one, but not big enough. 
Ooh, a four chain. Some strong bit of offense, but Galaxy Blitz has to do with some massive, massive combo garbage. Will he, will he get that going? We'll see. He gets that lined up. Doesn't quite get the line. Gets locked out. Venchu, one to nail. Oops, excuse me. I always read by my boy. Venchu found with a strong four chain right off the bat. Galaxy Blitz, what a bit of combo damage to start off today. And just like that, Galaxy Blitz already on the defensive. Angel has a little bit less garbage to work with here. Imagine, ooh. Five, five chain with a six combo. Ooh, Galaxy Blitz here. Five combo to clear. Manages to get that little roll out of the way, but still has that massive block to work with. Will he arrange it somehow? Okay, he plays it safe. He plays it safe I'm going for the heart in the clear. Uh, big brain move, he would have gone for six combo there at that moment. If, if he probably had a few more extra frames of, st of shake time, he probably would have gone for that. Ooh, but look at this. Galaxy Blitz takes the win. It's 1-1. One, one. So it's an even game right now. Oh, Vange trying to go for 7 chain, but I guess he cut it off right at 6, which I think was critical. Uh, when Galaxy Blitz uh, already on defensive. Uh, if Vange went for that bigger, um, bigger chain, he probably would have seen that coming. Galaxy Blitz would have seen that coming. Uh, I've done absolutely everything in his power to stop that. Uh, Vange here, but only 3 rolls of garbage to deal with. Meanwhile, Galaxy Blitz with 4 or 5 to deal with on all sorts of angles. Vinci arranges his blocks, doesn't go for the forward chain on the bottom there, but just rearranges him to have enough room here. Oh, Galaxy Blitz <laughs> arranges blocks in such a way, gives himself a little bit more room here. Oh, but doesn't quite get a match. Galaxy Blitz does not quite get a match. That's going to go 2 1 on the side of Vinci. 3 2 1 go, and here we go, just throw it in there. Fast as. Fast. Galaxy Blitz with a strong 6 chain. Bain Chu with a 3 chain with a bit of combo in there. Not as big as Bain Chu. Not as big. Well, not as big. Well, you know what I mean. Uh, right now. Oh. Galaxy Blitz is going strong on that offense right now. Throwing massive chains to Bain Chu. You know, meanwhile, Bain Chu is keeping it simple with some small uh, chains and mostly combo damage. We'll see that's enough. Uh, the problem with throwing massive chains is that you will have a limited source of blocks to work with. Uh, Bain Chu playing, playing it smart, being aware of the fact that if you throw massive chains, you have a few blocks to work with. So, uh, Bain Chu playing obviously on that strength here, but... Uh, ooh, gets that perfect timing in. Sweet stuff. I think Bain Chu is going to reply with a big old chain of his own. That's some 7 chain while he's throwing some bit of garbage here. Uh, we have him to uh, able to match, make a match. Ooh, matches those purples, but matches those blues to give himself a little bit more of stop, uh, a little bit more shake time. Smart move there from, uh, from Vangia here. Uh, meanwhile, that's a good. A combo into clear here. Uh, we are going to block for the eventual downfall of those garbage. Go, go, go! Go, go, go! Oh, but doesn't quite move at Vangia, though. Ooh, it is 2 2. It is very back and forth so far. One minute it's Vainchu, the next minute it's Galaxy Blitz. So this could be a very even game. As of right now, it seems very even. Galaxy Blitz, we're roaring 5 chain. Meanwhile, Vainchu sending a simple. Ooh, good amount of garbage here. A, I believe it's a 4 chain. But a couple of garbage. Uh, a couple of bits of combination garbage. Ooh. Vainture with some second tier blocks to work with, but I don't know if he make much out of it. Same for Galaxy Blitz. Not much, it's mostly combo garbage, but we really have enough time to clear that out. He's a big focus on garbage. Times two chain into clear here. Oh, good time. He could have gone for that seven, but he, he wanted to prioritize garbage clear, which is a smart move right there. Galaxy Blitz playing smart here. He's aware of Vainture's strategies now. You had it. Vain 2 chain here. Control your enemy. 
Very back and forth, I can tell you that well, honestly. Very back and forth. Control. Galaxy, but it's you near the top. It. Only has a few you blocks to, of garbage to work you with, but it's it. near the top. Spamming five combos, but would that be enough? Oh, it will not be enough. Venture takes that one. Three to two. Galaxy Blitz with a six chain. Venture with a seven. Ooh, both players are at the bottom. Only two or uh, only three or two, four blocks, rows of blocks to work with. Meanwhile, nothing but garbage, nothing but space. So it's only a matter of time of who can make the most out of their uh, random drop to see who can throw the most offense to keep themselves in the game. Ninja with a four combo into clear here. Three chain, four combo into clear, but here, Galaxy Blitz is throwing combos. Only small, only small four, co four times combos. Uh, four size combo, which is not bad. Ooh! Look at this guy, but again, three. It sounds three to three. It's just, it's very back and forth here. One minute it's one player, the next is another. Uh, but will this will this go on to the fourth round? Will this go on to uh, until it's game seven and game eight here? Uh, will it be very back and forth here? Uh, that's what we're seeing, but that's what we're expecting. Uh, Galaxy Blitz. Ooh, thank you. Keep it safe. Six combo here. Ooh. Guys even trying to make a move there, but couldn't quite do so. <gasps> Doesn't have enough time to move that bull block downwards and then over to the side. It's a lot of movements with a sh such a short time frame. You gotta be extremely quickly. Uh, no input mess ups for that. Uh, for that team. Vainture with an 8 chain. Goodness gracious, that is a big, massive chain to start off with. Excuse me. Oh, there we go. 5 to 4. Look at this. 5 to 4 for the side of Vainchu. So Vainchu wins 5 to 3. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. GG's to both competitors, they did a phenomenal job. Now it's going to be time versus a new entrant who is actually an old friend, an old uh, ally of ours. You may know him as the guy who invented um, Biggie Smalls here. He is that guy. He really is the one who did that. GCT versus Ty. Alright, let me go ahead and let this. Uh, reset this here. Ty GTC, whenever you're all ready. Uh, we are gonna have a couple. I'm gonna be honest with you. We might have a couple issues with in terms of quality. That being said, GTC is from the European region, whereas Ty is from the American region, and we have a couple of players being Tobodo and Kombota from the Japanese region. So somewhat international, not that much, but it is what it is. All right, whenever these two are ready to go. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Is he there? I see he is on the board. The other player is on the board. Y'all ready? They are ready to go. At least I believe they are ready to go. Alright, we are waiting on Ty. <laughs>
Oh, they're starting. Tide versus GT, uh, GCT. Alright, when both players are ready, y'all begin. Ty immediately working with his field, not even raising his stack, just working immediately with what he has here. Going for a simple two chain and a simple three chain with some combo garbage here. Uh, yeah, he doesn't have to raise his stack. Only working with what he's being given here. Doesn't raise his stack. Interesting play here. Uh, Miwon GTST here, already on the defensive here from, to uh, from Ty's offense so far. So good. Playtime is over. Oh, playtime is indeed over. Playtime is over. We'll see how everything goes here. Playtime well, is over. Oh, GC with a couple of blues, four combo into clear here. Has a very low stat, but no garbage to deal with until right now. Goes for four. Goes for five. He's gonna retaliate. Goes for six. Strong, solid six chain. Five combo into clear of that little garbage that Ty just sent his way. Ty here already on the defensive. Playtime is over. Being pressured very early on here. Nope. Time is over. Time just goes in time in tandem. Two chain into clear here. Meanwhile, GTC with little gar little garbage, but little blocks to work with. Is he gonna raise? Five clear, uh five combo into clear here. Four combo, another four combo. Little two chain meanwhile. Ty couldn't get that match in time. That's gonna give it to GTC. Oh, wrong score for you. There we go. Ty on the very bottom, GTC on the very top here. Goes for three. Ooh. Ty trying to readjust here. Goes for four into clear here. Uh, GCT here. Ooh. Times two. All right. Keep it simple. Keep it clean. Times two. Oh, but nothing. Nothing comes out of that one. DC trying to move his blocks around. All right. Here we go. He's got some movement here. Ty with a four. Ooh, some combo combos in his chains. That's smart. That's gonna be a very very strong offense. Oh, look at this. Oh, da 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 da. Oh, doesn't quite get that in. It's gonna be one one. There we go. With a very small amount of offense here. Meanwhile, GTC, GCT with a huge amount of garbage here. Uh, sending into Ty's way here. Are you gonna make it clear here? Uh, yes, he will. Look at this. Yellow eight to clear here. Meanwhile, Ty going for a four. Oh, two to one. Look at this. Oh, nope. All right, double Bowser's on Yoshi. Makes no difference, but still good to know. Time doesn't make that combination clear. Uh, GCT, five chain, six chain, seven chain. Strong offense so far, strong offense so far, but Ty, five combo into the clear. He's well aware. He's awake for this. Ty retires with a four uh, chain of his own. And here we go, uh, GCT. Power six. Ooh. Ooh, what a lot of combo combo garbage to work with. Five combo here. Uh, GCT with a massive chain. Oh. Doesn't quite get those greens matched up in time. Will he, uh, will he work with this? Yes, he will. Three chain into clear. He's going to keep that offense going here. All right, here. 
Ah. Ty with no garbage on his field, about to send uh, GCT some free punishment here. But GTC cuts his chain right on time, giving uh, Ty here something to work with. Something to work with, at the very least. on the fence and has second and third tier. Meanwhile, Ty has no garbage on his field right now. Oh, Ty's going too soon. He runs his garbage, but will he have enough to make a match of some sort? Ooh, matches those blues, matches those greens, matches those purples, keep himself alive. UTC matches those blues to keep himself alive. It's now basically a matter of who can keep each other, who is basically now a matter of wits, a matter of testament. Ooh, here we go. As you can see, as you can hear, everything is just going, ooh, going crazy right now. Up, oh, slow down, up, oh, never mind. GC2 with a 7 chain, going strong on the offense again. Both players are very even right now. Matt's going on for a good solid 2 minutes, but this is going to take a while until someone messes up an input here. Uh, nope, Magic Light Blue in the clear here. GCT with very few blocks very few blocks to work with here. Ooh, but has a good amount in second tier to work with. I wonder if you were going to notice that on the very top. Ty keeping his blocks at the very top here. Uh, GCT is running low here. Have a lot more blocks to work with. But he's going to make anything out of it. He's gonna have that extra reserve laying around. Not quite. Makes this ooh six combo into clear here. Meanwhile, time on the offensive. Is he gonna match those light blues? Yes, he is. He's gonna keep himself alive here. Both players have been going out of here. Uh, it's, I can say both of them are very skilled right now. They're giving it their all right here. And this is only the fourth game in, so I'm pretty sure by now uh, either GCT has figured out some sort of strategy or Ty has switched up his playstyle. To better suit his opponents. Um, doesn't quite go that way. Does not quite go that way. Oh. There we go. Ty with a strong 4 chain. GCT with only a 3 here. Uh, so obviously Ty is beating on him on the advantage game, but that's not really what matters. Not that much anyway. Yes, you can throw a massive chain to keep your opponents at bay, but at the same time, if your opponent is well aware, it's all about auditory here. If your opponent can hear you, if if your opponent can hear you setting up a massive chain at their way, they are more than likely going to be expecting to be ready for that. Uh, meanwhile, Ty here goes for the purple in the clear here. Uh, GCT working out that, uh, breaking that uh, garbage now. Six combo, but doesn't quite move those greens in time. Doesn't make, uh, doesn't have a follow up to that. Time matches those uh, those stars, but doesn't quite connect to anything here. So Ty trying to scurry, trying to make a match. So two, three, and four. Uh, that's what it's looking like right now. Two, three, and four, like so. in a bit of trouble here. He's gonna make that. Oh, he doesn't make those blues. He switches the blue into place, but then switches it back out. That is insane. Excuse me. Tower three. Ooh. GCT also with a three. I uh, wanted to follow up, but couldn't. Meanwhile, Ty cut it exactly at um, at his three, so he was aware of what he was doing. Makes that four combo, but doesn't have a quite match a connection with that. Anyway, let's see. That makes it clear. Ooh, doesn't quite worry. GCT has too many blocks to work with there. Four to two. Match point for Ty. If Ty wins, it'll be five to two. Ty moves on. Meanwhile, GCT is eliminated. Ah, uh, it's only match point though. We'll see. We'll see. Ty with some good amount of combo garbage to deal with, but makes that seven into clear, keeping himself alive and throwing GTC some of that counter, uh, sending him some of that counter attack, saying, hey, you throw combos at me, I'm gonna throw them right back at you. Meanwhile, uh, GCT here, flanning his stack here, moving his paddles around, trying to rearrange him for the eventual clear. Two, three, 
four. Well, I cut it short on the four here. Me won't I. Five and a six. Well, you're gonna follow up. No, we're gonna cut it at six. Solid offense from Ty. GCT. Ooh, kind of stuck there, but doesn't quite get a match in. Five to two on the side of Ty. And there we go. Fantastic. All right, I'm going to update the scoreboard real super quickly for you. While I do that, I'm gonna go ahead and message the next group, which I believe is semifinals now, which is uh, fantastic. Yay! Kudos. Awesome. Greatness. Ah, well, let me report the score. Good, good lord. Good, good lord. I click it once and it's like five minutes away. Goodness gracious. Like 500 frames. Excuse me. I like to put it to the scoreboard now. Oh well. Uh, the next match we're going to be having right now is going to be the semifinals. It's going to be, yeah, the semifinals right here. Let me go ahead and reset this nonsense. All right, we're gonna have the semifinals next. It's going to be Flying Turtle versus Compota. So, let me go and message these two real quickly, let them know that they are ready to go. Don't save my life. All right. I'm letting both players know they are their match is ready and they are ready to go. All right. We're gonna see what happens now. Go ahead and set this up like so. They have selected their characters. Up oh, wrong. Is it the right one? Is it the right one? Did I click the right one? How do you think they did not? No, I did not. Ah, here we go. Kapoda with, with the purest of pure chance. Uh, sticking it to Flying Turtle right now. Throwing a good amount of offense. Flying Turtle already on the defensive very early on today. Compota actually won then? Goodness gracious, that was intense. That was insane, considering the fact that Compota almost had no blocks to work with on her, uh, his board here. Anyway, Compota here actually might be going for a 20 combo with a 2 chain, that is massive. This is gonna be dangerous for Turtle here. Turtle here uh, is in a heap of trouble here. Um, we will say this right now, if Turtle loses, um, at any point, after in the, and currently in top eight, if Turtle loses, we are guaranteed a new champion, no matter what. So, uh, we'll see the um, Kompota here from Japan will take it home. But, um, it's only a matter of time. Both players on with very few blocks to work with, anyway. <laughs> yes, that is correct. Alright. So, we're trying to make matches, uh, trying to make some combos here on the retaliation of that. Those massive, massive 20. Uh, combos can really off throw somebody and right now it looks like he's off throwing turtle here uh, Compota here, ooh no, oh, no, doesn't quite get it. It is one to one. Compota couldn't make a match quite in time So that goes over to turtle one to one
we also like to remind people that if whoever loses this match will go on to third place. So essentially it's somewhat double them, except you don't go on, you just kind of have a third place match. Alright, let me get back to the action here, get the portal here. Ah. Doesn't quite get a match in, goodness gracious, that's gonna go to Turtle 2-1. Two to one. Kampota already, from the beginning, uh, rearranging her blunts like so. Mm, makes it clear here, but doesn't quite follow up with it. Again, uh, Kampota keeping it simple, keeping it simple, only throwing some bits of garbage here. Uh, small two chains and four combos, but would that be enough to uh, overwhelm Flying Turtle? Uh, sources say no, as Flying Turtle quickly dispatches off that garbage from Kampota and essentially deals uh, with the free punishment. Kampota with, ooh, with two possible, with two possible uh, options here on second tier. But will he notice that in time? It's only matter of time right now. Makes the four into clear here. Uh, but will that work out? Will he make a combination? Like, doesn't even notice the second tier. He's gonna go three to one. Flying Turtle already at the advantage. Kampota, 22 combo with a 2 chain, impressive, not bad, not bad. That's gonna be a very risky play considering how very close uh, Kampota was almost to losing at the very top of the screen. What a big risky play, but it managed to work out. Uh, both players here try to throw some offense, 2 and 3, ooh. Turtle's got a lot of combination work to deal with, so it's Kampota here, a lot of chain, but doesn't quite flatten the stack, it is now 4 to 1 match point. This is it. Will Kampoda pull off another massive combo, uh, combo game here to end it off? Nope, keeps it simple. Nope, goes, uh, keeps on, you know, garbage number four, five, and a six. Okay, solid. Oh, a seven out of nowhere. I'm surprised four into match here. Oh, this is going to go. Turtle matches. Oh, get those hearts in running time. Running time was actually this close to losing. This is match point now. So if Turtle wins, Turtle moves on to finals. And Turtle moves on to finals. What did I say? I didn't mean that as a joke. Five to one. Good clean sweep. A reverse sweep, essentially. Kampoda managed to pull off that combination uh, offense very early on. <laughs> the very early on surprise, but it doesn't really, really quite work out. It is five to one. All right, let me go and message the next available players. Uh, it's going to be uh, Sujumar. Venchu versus Tai. All right, here we go. Uh, let me update the score real quick, if it lets me, of course, obviously. Uh, five, one. All right, so Kompoto will play in third place, and whoever loses this match between Venchu and Tai will also move on to third place. Uh, let me go and update all the shenanigans for sure. Uh, I'm assuming Ty is going to be on the left, right hand side, and Venture is going to be on the left hand side. At least that's how it works most of the time, anyway. Alright, we are waiting against Venture versus Ty. Whoever loses this match goes on to third place. After third place, we're gonna have our finals and whoever wins in the final match will be declared the champion. So far, Flying Turtle has, has had a strong offense. He has dropped a couple games here and there, especially in Swiss rounds two. Uh, Galaxy Splits with a near loss of five to four, but Turtle has been uh, keeping his uh, Steady, steady uh, winning streak so far. So most likely he might remain chamber, but again, who knows? We are now waiting for Benchu to arrive here in the game. That way we can have the match go down, unless I am not watching this happen. Oh, there he is. All right, go, go. All right. Benchu right, versus Ty in semifinals. Here we go. Yep. 
in terms of the bracket, both players are very much even. Uh, we have decided to update uh, the system of tournaments and have decided to put in a ranking system. Uh, as of right now, currently in the stands, uh, as of right now, both Bang Chu and Tai share a similar set record. However, Bang Chu has the advantage due to the fact that he has won more games than Tai has. Tai has played more games, but has lost more games, more than Bang Chu has. Uh, therefore, Bang Chu has the advantage in terms of number of games. So my best prediction going uh, going into this uh, semifinals match is that it's going to be a somewhat long one. There is going to be some back and forth, but it's ultimately going to be one player or the other. My best prediction is going to be 5-3. Uh, no actual direct winner, but the score being 5-3. But who knows, really. This could go back and forth between those. Ooh. Vainchu with almost no garbage to work with, taking it easy here, only takes care of that small little garbage block, but that has that massive one right on its side, meanwhile Tai here trying to play extremely defensive early on, uh, being uh, put in such very, very precarious position right now. Ooh, ooh, bum, 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 and bum, bum, bum. Tai has some oh, doesn't quite get the, uh, doesn't quite flatten his snack to make any work of that. Vainchu one. Oh, guess that timing didn't like your bang you here. Uh, alright. Two chain into clear here. Ty would nope, never mind. With some garbage to work, but not that much. Easily dispatches it, no problem, absolutely not, but gets dealt with more. Essentially a backward game of who can keep sending the most amount of garbage in a fast amount of time. Um, as I've always said, if your board has no garbage, you essentially throw your opponent free punishment. The, that is not something you want to have to deal with. Uh, you always got to make sure you always constantly make sure your opponent has garbage. Make sure you keep them busy. You make, make sure they have something to do in the board. Uh, Vainchu getting rid of that garbage here. Ty easily dispatched that garbage to Vainchu sent his way. Got some free punishment with that combo. A little two chain here, a little three over there. Uh, but that has that to work with. Uh, Vainchu with a lot of blocks going up, but not entirely in its center. Ty here. We've got some shock panels now. We've got some of the great ones. Will Ty utilize those, or will he just uh, dodge around them? Uh, normally in level 10 gameplay, shock blocks uh, appear very rarely. It's essentially a not. The lower level you are when you play, the higher chances you get of shock block. The shock block, if you don't already know, matching three will give you one row of metal garbage blocks, which doesn't connect to the original color of the garbage that's being dealt. So it's going to be like a little bridge of work in between. Bane trying to work on second tier, but second tier disintegrate, matches the start right in place, gets that going for him. Ooh. Both players have their boards nearly topped off with blocks, but we'll see if they occupy for any sort of strong offense here. Vainchu with two. Vainchu makes that clear, goes for four, goes for six, but will he, will he have enough time? Yes he will, four combo into chain here, into clear. Hmm. Has some room on second and third tier, goes straight up to third tier and takes that down right in time too. Good timing, good timing. Ty with no garbage on his field. Never mind, there he is. We've already, um, we're two and a half minutes into this game. It's only game two. So as I've said, both players are going to go very back and forth. They're very much even when it comes to the rankings. So it's only a matter of time of one player per, uh, prevailing over the other. Due to sheer coincidence, sheer reaction time. Um, one thing a lot of players may not know is that this game is very um, reaction -y. Um, it's much le much more reaction heavy than other puzzle games like Puyo or Tetris. Most of those are set up. There is some setup as we've seen with uh, Kompata's combination attack, but generally speaking, it is mostly reaction based. Which means if you have, uh, if you're quick on the eye, if you're quick to pay attention, I think Ty's ta uh, Ty's stack just rolled and he couldn't do much about it. That is two to nil so far. Then she goes for a simple three. Cloister. Cloister. Can't win them all. 
Can't win them all. Tyree Tyree is back, but alright, Ty already on the defensive danger here. He's gotta deal with the second goal of nothing to work with here, but goes for four. <laughs> Real Rangers, second tier, actually comes down. I'm gonna take nope. you down. Six. Oh, never mind. Vayne Chu wins that one. Ty just couldn't have enough work here. This could be a This could be a sweep. We'll, we'll see though. It is currently the three, so we're waiting for the five and now the three again. Absolutely nothing to work with on this board. Oh, never mind. He's got something now. Oh, Vainchu wins it. It is now 4 0 match point for Vainchu. This actually could be a sweep here. Ty's gonna have to make a reverse sweep of some kind here to keep himself alive. This is as intense as it gets. Oh, but Ty Retali is with a 7 chain right off the bat. Will Vayne be put in trouble right away, or will that be it? What we're gonna find out. Vayne will get away that second tier, sending an 8th chain on his way. Massive. Massive. Will time make a jump? Ooh, makes up 2 into clear right on time. Keep himself alive here. Can he match anything? Matches those stars in place. Good for him. Good for him. He does not have this massive block of the chain to work with for time. I see a couple blocks in the second tier at the very, very top, but not enough to make her to make any sort of possible move. So that second tier is going to have to sit there quietly until it gets cleared all the way. Ty is probably going to be sending a big chain soon. Vain Chu is smart enough to probably prepare for that right now. And so he does with those purple people. Vain Chu is with a 7 chain of his own. Ty would block absolutely to the very top. He can't even see the garbage that's coming down to him, so he's going to have to break those down somehow, but he does it. It is a clean sweep for Vain Chu. 5-0. That is ridiculous to see, but it happens here. It truly does happen. All right. With that being said, we're going to go ahead and put in... Uh, Uh, will this thing not let me put in the map? After refresh the page, after refresh uh, challenge, every time I want to update the scores, because every time I click to write down the scores, it's like it takes an eternity. I don't know why it does that, but it does that. Anyway, oh my goodness gracious, this takes an eternity. Goodness gracious. All right, let me click the button. Let me update the scoreboard. Give me one second here, chat. Give me one second.
I'm about that chat. Uh, a lot of people come up. A lot of real life stuff. Uh, anyway, we're starting off third uh, third place match right now. Uh, time is coming up. Third place. Afterwards, it's going to be Flying Turtle versus Vainchu for that uh, Sweet Sweet Championship uh, title. Uh, they have played before, so it's only a matter of time to see how well they place here. Oh no, I'm not playing. Oh my god, I'm going to win. Bro, how am I dropping frames? Are you serious? No, never mind. We're coming back. We're coming back. We're coming back. I'm going to win. We apologize for those uh, massive frame drops. I could swear I have to still connect to Ethernet. This is the first time I've ever had since since Ethernet that I've dropped frames. This is ridiculous. Even if, even when I've done like massive like long streams, this is the first time I've seen drop frames. Uh, maybe we do get a drop frame. <laughs> Anyway, it is now 2-1 on the side of Ty. So Ty's actually going to be fighting back from this. Kapata here uh, doesn't quite get any sort of match in here. So it's going to be 3, oops, excuse me, 3. 2-1, what is Kapata going to be doing here? Kapata's going to be setting up for uh, some chain combo uh, offense at once. Kabon here, sitting in his, in his sweet time, trying to figure out, oh, two seven. Two chains, 70 combo, and the clear here. Ty, trying to work out what he's got here. Goodness gracious, goodness gracious. Ty runs. Oh, try to try to go for the four chain with stars here. Couple to here. Line goes up perfectly, just in time. Ooh, well. Four chain, four combo. Continuing with the offense here. Four. Oh, but doesn't quite go. Doesn't quite go for that. Four combo here. And, and a seven combo there. Well, we match up. Four combo, two for the clear here. Five combo for the clear here. Four combo, two. Ooh. Basically just non-stop action. Basically just quick pace. Uh, Ty here has is working on that garbage, but nope, gets retaliated back. Same thing with Kompona. Kompona has some work to do in second tier. I do see those queens that she could dispose of. He, well, he, I'm sorry. It's just, I say she because he plays uh, pure Chan. He's like the biggest advocate of pure, uh, the character. This man lives, breathes, and is pure chain. I, I essentially believe this man is just pure chain. Um, other than that, uh, Ty here. Ooh, they're very back and forth. Two minutes into the match already. Uh, this is game five, I believe. Uh, so basically, uh, if Ty wins this one, it's going to be match point for Ty. He's going to uh, stick it in with third place. But if Kompona wins or makes a reverse here, uh, he will probably take third place. And that will sit comfortably in fourth, but nothing will like that is going to be the case. It's 4-1, match point for Ty. Fool. Fool. Kapona trying to go for the massive combo. Uh, combo game, but doesn't didn't quite work for that. Will this be it? Will this be it? Oh, will that be it for Kapona? Oh, but matches with uh, yellow right in time. Look at this. This is cool. This is truly what it is. This is what it be, and this is what it do. Kapona here, lining up uh, the panels. I'm going to win. As they say. Uh, same thing with Ty, lining up the panels. I'm going to win. Three possible. Um, essentially, that's essentially the I'm key factor. If, think about, the thing about it is when you match, when you make a match with that touches I'm garbage, going to when win. they clear, there is a chance that uh, Ty wins. Uh, there is a chance that you're going to get exactly what you need lined up. Five to one. So there we go. 
five to one on the side of Ty here. With this thing, still a three second shot. Challenge, be weird like that. Challenge really do be weird like that. Anyway. So anyway, component wins third place, and I still gotta update this thing. Are you serious, bro? Oh my goodness gracious. All right. Give me about one second, because this thing apparently did not update. I, it says saving, and it's saved, okay? And then this one was four, five to one. One, five. And now we have, ladies and gentlemen, the grand finals. Oh my God, don't tell me my app crashed again. It happens. All right, well, give me time. It gives me time to set this whole thing up. Lord challenge, please. Yes, it, it does that. Challenge just sometimes doesn't want to work. All right, we are now at the finals. Oh, never mind, it works. Uh, Flying Turtle versus Vain Chu. All right, Flying Turtle versus Vain Chu for the finals. Uh, apparently, once you play a song in this game long enough, it will just reset. Like, it, it actually won't. It won't reset. It will just stop. Let me go ahead and update this. So whenever those two are ready, I can see them. There, yep. They're selecting their characters. They're selecting their names. One, two, three, four, go! And that was that was fast. This game, the program just knows. Like three, two, one, go! And that's exactly what happened. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> anyway, early on, early on, uh, Flying Turtles going with some massive garbage here. Uh, not enough though. Uh, he's well aware. Vain Chu here has a couple of works on second tier. But we knocked it down somewhat. Line set up like so. Uh, oh, not control up. Flying Turtle, my baby. I gotta figure out a better way to. I have to figure out a better system to change these names that I have to type them out every single time. I if, if only if there was a will, there was a way. I'll figure something out. Anyway, first point goes to Vain Chu. Uh, I do want to let you know that if Vain Chu wins, Vain Chu is declared champion, and Flying Turtle becomes the contender. But who knows? Bain Chu with a 7, Bain Chu with an 8 combo, with 8 chain, but off the bat, Flying Turtle going all the way high up to try to counteract that, but ooh. Lining them up, lining them up, going for a 5. Bain Chu is aware of 2nd tier, makes a 6 combo right as the tier breaks. That is a strong, strong offense for Bain Chu very early on. Turtle right now trying to do his best to keep himself alive here. Already dropped one game to Vain Chu, so this could be as even as even can be. Uh, as I stated, the other only other person to have a good record is Vain Chu. Vain Chu is, in all honesty, our one our number one contender for the championship. So uh, it would be a good story written if Vain Chu would win, but who knows? We'll see. Getting dealt with some garbage. He's got a lot of common garbage up there to work with. He feels like he's gonna have a good amount of room. Uh, but Benji lines up those greens just in place, just waiting for that to break down. Ooh, moves that out of the way. Four combo into clear here. Turtle with. Uh, keep getting pelted with combination garbage here and there. A combo, four combo from Bane Chu. Bane Chu now has to deal with combo combo. Imagine if we get those connected in one place. Uh, good stuff, good going, good showing. Flying Turtle with a combination got being pelted, but he's aware he caught that on immediately. Keep himself alive, has a lot in second tier. I don't know if he breaks that down, breaks that down. All in one conglomerate here. Goes for two, goes for three, goes for another two, goes for another three. As you can see, especially around this type of speed, uh, when both players are being pelted with garbage, it's essentially a matter of who can throw out a good amount of good solid offense early on. Early on, it's essentially go for massive change, but then going forward, 
It's essentially combos, combos, maybe a chain or two, maybe two or three. You get lucky if you manage to get anything bigger than a four chain. Turtle here goes for two, goes for two. All right. Vein Chu matches those in time, in tandem. Two, three, four. All right, good four uh, from Vein Chu here. Oh, Lions is up with a six combo, two chain. Back to the blues. Vein uh, Vain Chu keeping himself alive here. Turtle keeping himself alive here. Almost three minutes into this match. It's only the second game. So it's only going to be a matter of time before someone's offense, someone's concentration breaks. But until then, uh, they're probably going to go at it for goodness, goodness knows how long. Um, I haven't actually kept track of what, was, what has been the longest match, but it's something I should be doing, but oh no, but that unfortunately will have to be cut short. Uh, turtle match to get that in 1-2-1. One, one. So we'll see what happens here. Turtle can go for a reverse sweep and end this right now. But Vainchu is not going down without no fight. Seven chain right off the bat. Lines that up perfectly. Another four chain to deal with Turtle. Turtle here. Ah, uh, has uh, immediately on the defensive, so you can make that clear. Stars into clear here. Four chain um, from Vang Chu. Gonna keep that clear. Five, six. Good timing on Vang Chu here. Seven. Ooh, Lions is up going for eight. Vang Chu wins. Ooh, this might be a tough one. Turtle's gonna have. Turtle's. Vainchu is giving Turtle a run for his money right now. He's going to make him work to keep that championship on him. Uh, best case scenario, uh, worst case scenario. Best case scenario, he's, he's in it to win it. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Turtle with no garbage on his field, never mind. Only just a small little smidgen. They're about to give Vain uh, to some uh, free punishment here. Four, co uh, four combo, another four combo. No, no, most likely not. Line this up perfectly. How's this gonna work? Huh. Vain to here. Ooh, going massive on the. Going massive on the chains with combos here. Turtle manages to connect those um, greens into clear here. Look at this. Flying Turtle has some room on second tier. Nothing to make any combination of any sort. Doesn't quite get the match. Oh my goodness. 3 to 1. Oh, this might be Vain Chu. This might be the year of the Vain Chu. I think Turtle's luck is running to low sin. We might, we might start off the new year with a new champion. Who knows? We'll see, we'll see. 3 to 1, still anyone's game here. But Vainchu, though, going strong on the offense. 7 chain right off the bat. Doesn't move the star in place. That's going to give it to Turtle. One lousy mistake. One, ooh, rookie mistake right there. 3 to 2. As I said, it's anyone's game. Another 7, another 7 chain over here from Vainchu. But I'm pretty sure, uh, yeah. Oh, it's about yeah, it's about identical. It's about identical. Turtle threw an all an identical seven chain right on the side of Bainchu. I think he realizes with Bainchu he's gonna have to throw the same amount of offense. It is now three and oh oh excuse me hold on three 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 three. Yep, it's even now. Ah, uh, so whoever wins this one is getting match point for one person. This is this is ooh, we're getting close. To it. Really, really cool. Turtle automatically with a seven. Vain Chu switching up his playstyle here, going for combo damage instead. Ooh, good timing. Two, three, and four in quick succession. That is cool. You, you love to see those type of quick uh, flame perfect tricks. It's always a blast to see. Ooh, two with a nine combo. This is insane. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Uh, line him up, line him up. Oh, four combo. He's gonna match those up. Yes, he is. No way he's gonna let those become garbage. Wait a minute, he's gonna go. Oh. Oh, match point for Vang Chu. If Vang Chu wins it, Vang Chu is champion. This is as close as close can get. Match point for Vang Chu. Five, six, seven. Mwah. Vang Chu's defense. Damn straight. Mwah. Beautiful. You'll love to see it. This could be it. This could be it. Ooh. 
We're getting extremely close here. If Turtle can manage to win this one more game, it is going to be match point. It's going to be as close as close can be. Goodness gracious. Vain to win after that three combo was setting up that uh, clear with just a normal clear. Clear on clear. That's how it'd be. That's what it do. Same thing with Turtle. Clear on clear here. Ooh, four combo into clear here. Another... Ooh, no, just keep it playing safe. Playing safe. I would say play, playing safe is essentially going for a clear. Pulling off a clear just to pop some garbage blocks. Not going for anything fancy, not going for a massive chain. Just going for a simple three, and there you go. Just get rid of that garbage as soon as possible. Uh, Turtle with more blocks than to work to know what he can work with here. Ooh, being gracious. Will this be it? Will this be it? No? Ooh, it's all riding on this game. We need one more. Turtle's gotta win one. Turtle's gotta win two more to keep that belt of his. Keep that name. Um, keep that special special color on his Discord. We'll see here. But ain't you? Oh, that's all three. Another spam combo brother. He's gonna connect. No, he doesn't connect it. He doesn't connect it. It is five to three, ladies and gentlemen. We have a new champion. Holy goodness gracious, we have a new. Champion! Wow, congratulations! Congratulations, Vain Chu, you are now the panel attack champion. First things first, I gotta strip my man here of his title. Poor, poor him. I'm sorry, I have to diss him. Poor, poor Turtle. Turtle had a really good run. Two months of having the championship. But sorry, that's got to be taken away. I am so sorry. You are now down to a silver. And now we got a ward. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Vain Chu is our new Panel Attack Champion. Congratulations, Vain Chu. Congratulations to everyone. Thank you guys so much for participating. It was a lot of fun. I had fun hosting the tournament. It was a lot of fun having everyone around. Once again, I do want to say thank you guys very much. Uh, I'm going to go end up the stream, and I'm going to go talk to my boys over at the Discord. Let them know what's up. Let them know how everything's going to be going. Uh, for those of you who tuned in, who watched from my perspective, thank you very much. Uh, we madly appreciate it. Uh, the next tournament is going to be, it's every first Saturday of the month. So, in February, February 6th, Saturday. I don't know what time, I'll keep you guys posted on that. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and end on the stream here. I'm going to talk to my boys and let them know what's up. Alright guys, peace.